my caterpillars hope you're all okay um i thought i would do another story for you and today i'm gonna do the very hungry caterpillar in the light of the moon a little egg lay on a leaf there it is look On Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop, out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. He started to look for some food. wonder what he's going to find. Here we are, look. On Monday, he ate through one apple but he was still hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums, and he was still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through one, two, three, four strawberries and he was still hungry. He's a very hungry caterpillar. On Friday he ate through one, two, three, four, five oranges but he was still hungry. On Saturday he ate through one piece of cake one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of cheese, one salami, one lollipop, one cherry pie, one sausage, one cupcake, a slice of watermelon and that night he had a tummy ache. He ate so much food. The next day he was it was Sunday again. The caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf and after that he felt much better. Now he wasn't a hungry caterpillar anymore and he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore either. He was a big fat caterpillar. Look at him, all that food he's eaten. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed his way out until he came out of the cocoon and he wasn't a caterpillar anymore. He was a beautiful, beautiful butterfly. Oh, that's a nice story and that's just for, for us caterpillars that is. I like this story and I, it's good that we're sharing stories this week and you're going to tell us your favourite stories as well. Bye bye caterpillars. <laughs>